Jhargram is that location of nature where beauty of forest, hills, river and waterfall are at the same place. Not only the scenic beauty but also friendly people who inhabit this place will make the heart swell with happiness. The dense forest is home of different species of birds and animals. The life and culture of tribal population gives the actual feeling of happiness. So now let's know about the top visiting places at Jhargram. In number one in our list we have the Sabitri temple. This temple is about 350 years old. The stone idol of Sabitri Devi is being worshipped by Mallav Dev royal family for several centuries. A big pond behind the temple gives a nice scenic beauty. Goddess is worshipped strictly according to the Puranas, the ancient Hindu religious text. The rituals of Durga Puja are still organized and performed by the royal family of Jhargram. In number 2 in our list we have Jhargram Raj Palace. Jhargram Raj Palace is one of the precious attractions of Jhargram. It is a big and well decorated palace with unique architectural attraction. It was built in 1931. This palace was designed by Calcutta Improvement Trust during the reign of Raja Narsingha Mallabte Bahadur. This palace is silent witness of huge historical incidents. This palace can be seen in many popular films. About 15 of the rooms in the ground floor have been converted into a heritage hotel which provides room for people who wish to stay in the palace. In number 3 now list we have Bandarbhula Tribal Interpretation Center. Jhargram has a rich legacy of art and culture. The beautiful forest welcome you to the essence of nature. It is home to different tribes including Mundas, Santals, Lodhas, etc. This place will offer you a mix and match of vibrant tribal dances. The state tourism department has been showcasing glimpses of tribal life through Jhargram's tribal museum that was inaugurated by West Bengal's chief minister Nanta Banerjee. These complex houses of tribal museum displays indigenous tribal culture of the district. Tribal folk performances are held here on weekends and visitors can enjoy food at the in-house restaurant. This museum is a must visit and you get to see various vignettes of local life and culture. In number 4 in our list we have Jhargram Mini Zoo. The Mini Zoo or Jangal Mahal Zoological Park will provide a rewarding experience to the visitors of wildlife region. Wildlife is displayed and cared in such a way to allow awareness and to promote conservation of wildlife. This zoological park was opened by the State Forest Department. Deers, snakes, crocodile, black rabbit, wolf, peacock, bear and various types of monkeys and several varieties of trees can be seen here. It covers around 33 acres of well forested land. There is a total number of 187 mammals, 153 reptiles, 74 different bird species. It is a place that provides education and as well as amusement to the tourists. In number 5 in our list we have Tapabon Forest. Tapabon is a sacred place for many people in India. It is situated on the banks of the Shurbanaka river. This forest land is considered the most holiest among the local people from the ancient time. It is believed that this place was the ashram of great Balmiki of Ramayana. One can visit Lopkush Mandir, Sita Kundo and Sita Nala here. It attracts thousands of devotees every year during the Makar Shankranti, Poor Shankranti and other occasions. In number 6 in our list we have Rameshwar Temple. The Rameshwar Temple is located beside Surbanaka River. It is about 65 kilometers away from Jhargram. Local people believe that Sita requested Ram to construct the temple of Lord Shiva. It is believed that this temple was constructed with assistance of Vishwakarma. The temple is of ideal combination of architecture and science. The amazing fact about the temple is that it has no window but still sunlight comes inside the temple. In number 7 in our list we have Jilly Lake. Are you looking forward to a place where you can have a day out picnic? Well then Jilly Lake is a perfect place for spending some quality time with friends on the shores of some water body. The huge water body in the forest gives a scenic beauty. Huge number of migratory birds can also be spotted during winter. It is full of fun in the daylight but as the sun sets, the area gets completely deserted. However, people in search of real adventure can stay here. This lake takes up a new look in the evening and in the moonlight. You can sit idle and feel the ambience or spend some quality time with your loved ones. In number 18 in our list we have 
Konak Durga Temple. The century-old Konak Durga Temple is located in the forest beside a small charming river named Dulung. Several uncommon species of trees, birds, and monkeys can be seen here. The main history of Konak Durga Temple revolves around a dream. Devi Mahamaya came in a dream and ordered King Gopinath to set up a temple for her, and she also described her idol. On the next morning, King Gopinath found two visitors who saw the same dream at night. It was artist Jogindranath Kamaliya who transformed the dream into reality. Some says that Devi Konak Durga is Devi Chandi. She is believed to be the goddess of power and energy. In number 9 in our list we have Kagra. Kagra is an attractive place where people get fascinated at the sight of attractive nature and of the river currents against the rocky boulders. It is about 7 km north from Belpahari. It is actually a waterfall passing through a granite of black stone. The word Gagra came from the word Gagra which means colors filled up with water. Actually, the shape of the canyon is like a colors which is nothing but a pot to carry water. This is the place where shooting of the old film Bevara Lokhindar took place. During rainy season, Gagra waterfall becomes more beautiful and attractive. In number 10 in our list, we have Hathibari. In Hathibari, one can spend an unforgettable weekend in the isolated jungle where one can forget about worries of city life and become part of nature. Jhargam Mahakumar Hathibari is located on the Konjan territory of states of West Bengal, Odisha and Jharkhand. It is the perfect destination to relax without being disturbed by anyone or anything. The ambience of the river and the forest will make you speechless and intoxicated.